it's uh, been a real good night for us. I was pleased, obviously, with, to get through and, and that experience, even though it's a long night for everyone, but it was great for young players. And as I said, it's good to win, no matter how you win. Um, we we played okay in the game. Um, didn't create a great deal, to be honest, but we showed good perseverance to keep going. And like the way it is at the moment, we make too many mistakes, and that, um, and we got punished for that uh, in the game. But the players showed great resilience and mentality to keep going. And then at the end, whenever uh, it was needed, they showed wonderful composure. Some of our young players stepping up to uh, to take the penalties, and obviously we're very happy to get into the next round. Incredible quality in penalty shoots. Yeah, I thought both teams, in all fairness, you know, it was very difficult even to keep the scores. Um, so, uh, no, it was real good quality and Middlesbrough, you can see why, you know, they're a good side, well organised, you can see why they're up near the top of the, the, the championship and, uh, and we wish them luck now for the rest of their season. But tonight was a good night for our young players, I felt. Young Jordan Rossiter at 17 years of age playing, you know, Jordan could walk to, to Anfield here, he just lives around the corner. Delighted for him, got the opportunity and, and he showed a wonderful finish. Uh, and composure to get his finish. Um, I was also impressed with young Jordan Williams. Came on, showed real good stature, good composure in the game. He's a wonderful footballer and a, and a young player that's developing well. And I mentioned to young Social, hasn't had a lot of game time at all, but he's kept working every day. And I thought he came on was really bright for us and took his goal very well. Pleased with having a lot of tonight. Uh, good 20 minutes there. That was famous and his quality was there for all the season. Yeah, I think for all our players tonight and. You know, like Sav Adam, who, as I said, is, is still, he's probably in his pre-season phase because he, had, he hadn't played over the course of the pre-season because of injury. Uh, so um, so for him to get the game time was, was really good. I was really impressed with Jose Enrique because Albert Adom is, I seen Albert when I was in the championship with Swansea City and I know how good a player he is and how fast he is and there's not many quicker than Albert and I thought that Jose coming in and playing the whole game against him, I thought he was outstanding. So, uh, but great for the, the spirit of the team you know the, the dressing room is very happy we got through and as I said we're into the next round well, what does the future hold for you both you and Jordan I mean you know you put them in at a very early age yeah, opportunity I think that's the biggest thing that a young player can want I think all the young kids from our under 8s 9s in the academy now and all the academy coaches look at that tonight and they know anyway through my work that I will always look to them because my my job is to to grow the top class young talents, not just to, to buy them in. We want to try and grow them here and or else there's no point in having a youth academy. So for him to come in, Jordan and play and score was was fantastic for him and, and as I said, for the other couple of young kids that weren't involved, they're getting good experiences and, and tonight is a, a great night on, on their step to towards playing for the first team regular hopefully. Winning games is very important though, doesn't it? Now, Sorry? Through, sorry, winning games very important through to the next round it must be yeah. just to be in the draw. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. We haven't started great the season but Whilst we're still find, finding our form, you know, I think we were shown in the cup games and tournaments, you know, the Champions League game and this game that we certainly have that character and fight. So tonight <clears throat> was a good night to get through, and, and as you say, we're into the next round. For all it's great for the spirit that you're getting through. Is it also something of the ultimate nightmare with what you've got coming up? <clears throat> Not really. No, I think for most of the majority of the guys, they needed the game time. I think that. I was pleased with, with the minutes that the players got, most of them got. Um, we had a similar situation when we had played North County. You know, a lot of the, when I played probably even a more senior team that night, we ended up, we got through in the end, but went into extra time uh, and won the, the game at the weekend against Manchester United 1 0. So, uh, so tonight is good for our spirit, good for the camaraderie in the group to win like that. And now we've got a bit of time now to prepare. And get ready for a massive game at the weekend. It's getting late. <laughs> no, not at all. No, I um, I just felt, as I said, we're, we're making mistakes at the moment. Too many mistakes. You know, the the first goal I was disappointed with, and obviously, in it, and even more so, the second goal in control of the game Middlesbrough's legs were just about gone we didn't need to offer them any encouragement and we give the ball away 
sloppily and they go through and, and get the penalty. So, uh, so no, we, we made it hard for ourselves, but uh, but thankfully the, the quality and the perseverance of the players got us through. And for me, job done. I don't need to be jumping up and down. I, we, we win, we go through, well played Middlesbrough and well done to us and, and let's get home.